Hamza Chamaya versus Bo Nickel needs to happen since both have been throwing shots at each other and both are very skilled. Who to actually win this fight? Well, before we talk about who to win this fight, let's take a look at their latest performances. Boy, always doing too much. My boy, is this alcohol? Acting like a kid is alcohol. Shit. In which Hamza Chamaya fought Kevin Holland. In which Hamza Chamaya started off very fast with a lot of wrestling and with a lot of grappling. In which he got Kevin Holland in a Bravo joke and made him tap in round one. He might tap. It looks like his right hand was breaking. Yeah. That's how quick. At this, Hamza Chamaya went up to fight Kamara Usman, in which Kamara Usman got a late notice, and Hamza Chamaya again started off very fast with a lot of wrestling and with a lot of grappling, and Hamza Chamaya's ground game was great. All landed Kamara Usman, and Hamza Chamaya ended up taking it by decision. For the winner, by majority decision, Hamza Bush! Now let's take a look at Bo Nickel's latest performances, in which he fought Valentine Woodburn, in which Bo Nickel TKO'd him in round one. <laughs> At this, we all know that he went up to fight at UFC 300 and which he fought Cody Brundage and which Bo Nickel took control of the whole entire fight with his wrestling, grappling, and ground game and which he got Cody Brundage in a rear naked joke and made him tap in round two. Now, what's funny is that during fight week for UFC 294, Hamza Chamayev was being interviewed in which they asked him for his opinion on Bo Nickel saying that his wrestling is trash and that his American wrestling would be Hamza Chamayev's wrestling and with something that Hamza Chamayev said in this interview that stood out to me was the fact that he said that we're not wrestling for points so even if Bo Nickel takes him down, he'll get back up. So basically, Basically stating that Bo Nickel's wrestling is better than his because he sees that Bo Nickel knows how to win a fight with this wrestling. But then another thing that Hamza Chamayev said that stood out to me was the fact that he said we're not wrestlers and we don't stand or fight like wrestlers. We're MMA fighters. So Hamza Chamayev definitely has a point there. Now who's right and who's wrong here? Well, I think when it comes to wrestling, Hamza Chamayev might take it because he does have the experience against high level fighters like Gilbert Burns, Kevin Holland, and Kamaru Usman. And let's remember Kamaru Usman is such a great grappler as he's known for having good takedown defense and he's good when it comes to controlling his opponents on the ground. And Hamza Chamayev still managed to outperform him when it came to grappling and when it came to wrestling but let's not forget that Bo Nickel is a gold medalist in wrestling so that definitely gives him a lot of credibility but when talking about what he has done in the octagon he definitely needs more experience against ranked fighters so that way we know where he truly ranks so in the end from the looks of it, it would definitely be a close and competitive fight there would definitely be a lot of wrestling and a lot of grappling throughout the whole entire fight but we first got to see what Hamza Chamayev is able to do against Robert Whitaker so that way we can use that fight to determine how good Hamza Chamayev is when it comes to fighting one of the best in the division